Y'all be on here like a real natural. <laughs> Hey curl friends, it's underscore sincerely Asia and I'm back at it again with another video and this one is featuring Janet Collections Natural Me Lace Wig Line. I'm going to be trying on two synthetic wigs from their collection. So if you would like to see how I apply these wigs, how I make them look natural, my tips and tricks on, you know, how I give the girls a little look. Just keep watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you enjoy. We're just going to get right into this look. I'm going to try on two wigs today. These are both from the Naturally Me collection. Natural Me, excuse me. 100% premium fiber lace wigs. And I'm super excited about them. They have very deep parts. I watched a couple YouTube videos of other people who reviewed these same two wigs. And they seem to be like top tier bestsellers. I also have another really fun non-wig related look that's going to be coming from Jana Collection next month. <laughs> so be on the lookout for that. And that's enough chatty chat. We're going to get into this wig. So, I've already cut the lace. But I haven't done anything but cut the lace. Like, I wanted to do everything on here with y'all. And my mirror is right down here. So, I wanted to zoom in to show you guys that Jody came with three clips. Two in the front and one in the back, honey. So that's, that's the box. It's cute. Um, I'm definitely gonna cut it. it ain't no no cut that bitch off. So let's jump right into my styling. Basically, with every wig, I usually take a piece at the parting and cut it. I have a widow's peak, so it's a perfect place to cut and lay a little bit of baby hairs on top of my widow's peak. It's already there. It's just a hack that I have to do no matter what because that hair is going to show anyways. So now that we have like, this widow's peak, I think next I'm about to go in. So I'm just going to take this and just... Her name is Jody, by the way. Like, how did I not mention? Her name is Jody. And, um, like, when I saw the girl put this on, I was like, ooh, I need that. That's a weekend wig right there. So I got my first two mousses I saw. But I know for a fact, Records Roots is black on, so we're going to go in with that one. Mousse is a great way to manipulate wigs. It never damages, and it's always fixable. You can never have too much mousse. Then I just grab any kind of scissors. I could have grabbed kitchen scissors, but I had shears on hand. And I go and lightly start framing my face. Let's talk about Jody. Because I just might be Yvette. <laughs> Listen. So, like I said, this wing is from... Janet Collections Natural Hairline and Natural Yaki Texture. I was going for more like, you know, Foxy Brown meets Farrah Fawcett than anything. So, that's what I wanted in my spirit. So, I chose the Yaki Texture. It's a lace wig, 100% premium fibers with a deep parting lace. You, you, you be the you be the judge of that. I think it's so like, mmm, like this could be my hair. Girl, quit playing. Quit playing, Jody. Quit. Quit playing. So let's get into who's next? Yana. Let's get into Yana, okay? As far as Jody went, I really like her. She's like 
five star. Like I really love how Jodi looks on me. I bought Yana because she looks like a look that I tried to create on myself. I'll attach a photo here. It was probably like two years ago I tried to create this look, but it I just look, ended up looking like a child. Like it just wasn't. The, it just didn't turn out how I envisioned it to look. And then when I watched YouTube videos on Yana, I just thought, you know, she might be the way to go. So this is going to be a full unboxing of Yana. I was super excited for Jody, so I opened her up. Just, I just couldn't help myself. But Yana, I was able to be patient with her. And we're about to open her together. So this is what it looks like. This is a side part, Jodi was a middle part, so we gonna see what alterations we have to make to her, if you need it all. We don't even gotta do all this, okay? So she comes like this, I can tell she's very curly, so we're just gonna get straight to it. I'm gonna be looking down most of the time because my mirror is right here. Before I cut the lace, I like to just try it on to make sure she's going to be cute. And Yana also came with three combs, which you're going to see in just a second. Uh, mm -hmm. You know what? I already, I, I have a good feeling about sis. So I'm about to cut this lace because I, I don't know. That just kind of spoke to me for a second. I make sure when I cut the lace to go really, really close. I don't care if I make a few hairs because I leave my own baby hairs out. Mm. I'm already liking this flavor. definitely going to separate but this is very similar to the look that I had and it was just too young for me just like I did with Jody I'm going to take a little hair from the right side of the part and the left side of the part and cut it but not too short and then I'm going to grab some style factor and just you know lay and swoop the edges to mirror my natural hair that I have out. So next I'm gonna take some concealer and we're just gonna run down this part. I'm gonna go grab some Rutgers Roots Mousse and I'm gonna go ahead and start fluffing out and separating these curls. I think I'll like it a lot more if I just gave it a little bit more volume. Workers Roots is a black owned, family owned, female owned business. The Jana Collection is also black owned. So this is Yana. What do you guys think? The parting is perfect. I think it looks very natural. I love the part. It's so deep. I just love this collection overall from Janet. Like, I just, it's just so pretty. It looks so natural. Um, this one doesn't look as natural as Jody. Like, Jody is just that girl. And I will put her back on because that's, that's the intro and outro wave. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see y'all in the next one. Please be on the lookout because I have some very cute content coming up that I'm really excited to try. It's going to be my first time trying. Obviously, y'all first time seeing. So, if it's a bust, it's a bust. But I, I believe in me. Period. So, we'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching.